In this video, Timmy's going to show you how to exit full screen mode on a Chromebook. So, if your Chromebook is stuck in some sort of full screen mode, whether it's a full screen video, or you've got an app or website in full screen mode, and you want to get out of full screen mode and get back to normal, in this video, Timmy's going to show you how. Exactly what you need to do to get out of full screen mode will depend on what you're doing and how you ended up in full screen mode in the first place. But Timmy's going to show you all the different situations where you might be in full screen mode and the methods you can use to get out of them. The method that's probably most likely to work is the full screen key on your keyboard. Every Chromebook has one. It's this little key here that looks like a rectangle with two different lines inside it. And if you press this key while you're on a website or in pretty much any app on your Chromebook, it will go into full screen mode and the app or website will take up the full screen. And then if you press it again, it will go out of full screen mode and go back to normal. So if you've got a website or app that's in full screen mode, taking up the whole screen like this, you probably just need to press the full screen key. So Timmy will press it now, and then you'll be out of full screen mode. So that was doing it with a website, but if you had something like the Files app or something like that in full screen mode, you would just press the key very much the same, and that would be taken out of full screen mode as well. So that's one of the common full screen mode situations you might find yourself in, but another common reason you might be in full screen mode is if you're watching a video in full screen, like a YouTube video or a movie on Netflix or anything really. And if that's the case, there are actually a few different ways to get out of scre full screen mode. So when you're in full screen mode with a video, like to me is here, watching Tech Time with Timmy on YouTube, one of the options is to just press that full screen key Timmy showed you before, and it might not work with all apps or websites, but it certainly works quite well with YouTube and probably most other websites. So if you just press this key, it will go back to normal. But if you don't like that method or it doesn't work for the video you're watching, to me, I'll just bring up full screen mode again. You can also press the escape key as it's telling you up here. So if you were to just press this escape key, that would take you out of full screen mode as well. And another option, this is really the last option. Another option is to click on a button down here. So you might not see anything else on the screen if the video is playing. So you probably just need to pause the video or maybe just move your mouse around or something like that. But then you should see a exit full screen button. And it might look slightly different depending on what website or app you're watching the video on. But there should be something like that that looks a bit like it would exit full screen. And then you can just click that button and that will take you out of full screen as well. So. Those are all the ways you can exit a full screen video on your Chromebook. And the last potential situation Timmy's going to show you where you might be in full screen mode is if you're in a certain app that you got from the Google Play Store that forces you to be in full screen mode. A lot of games or some other apps that you install from the Google Play Store were actually designed to be used on phones or tablets, so some of them have to be in full screen mode in the entire time you use them, and there's no way around this, but you can still quite easily minimize the app or go to a different app if you want to. So when you're in one of these apps, as you can see, Timmy's in this racing game here. If you move your mouse to the very top of the screen and just leave it there for a second, you'll see you get this bar up here that would normally be at the top of your app if you weren't in full screen mode. And now, if you click the minus or minimize icon here, it will minimize it just like any other app. So now you're no longer in full screen mode and you're just looking at 
everything else on your Chromebook. And as you can see, the app is down here. So when you want to go back to it, you can just click this app here and you'll be back in. And when you want to completely close the app so that it's no longer open at all, it's pretty much the same as Timmy just showed you. You would just move your mouse right up here and leave it for a second, and then you get a cross button, which works just like any other cross button on any app. So that's really cool, but you can also just switch to a different app if you want. So if you move your mouse all the way to the bottom of the screen and leave it there for a second or two, you get the regular bottom bar that you normally see when you're not in full screen mode. So if you want to see the time or your notifications or anything here, you can do that. Or if you just wanted to switch back over to Google Chrome or maybe the Files app, you could just click on one of those apps here and the app would open up and then you would kind of not be in full screen mode anymore. So those are really all the main situations to me can think of where you might be in full screen mode on your Chromebook. But if you have something else in full screen mode that to me hasn't shown here, if you just try pressing the full screen key or maybe the escape key, one of those keys should really work for most situations. So hopefully this helped to get your Chromebook out of full screen mode. And if you want to learn how to use split screen on your Chromebook to easily have two different apps on the screen at the same time, Timmy shows you how to do that in this video here.